In this video, we're going to install Eclipse. So the first thing you want to do is make sure you have Java JDK already installed. And also, if you're using the JDK 64-bit version, you're going to want to install the Eclipse 64-bit version. And if you're using the JDK 32-bit version, you're going to want to have the Eclipse 32-bit version. So it's just something to, to double check before you download Eclipse. So to download Eclipse, let's just go to Google and type in Eclipse Download. Should bring up uh, the very first link. Now under Eclipse Downloads, uh, you could choose what version you want. Because I'm using uh, Java, I usually always go with the Eclipse Standard version. If you're not sure what version to install, you can always go and click on this Compare and Combine Packages. And this will show you uh, what each version has, what's included, and in, in what. And then you can make your decision based on what's included in what version. So for me, I'm just going to install the standard version. And because I'm using a JDK 64-bit, I'm going to download the Windows 64-bit for Eclipse. I'm going to select the top mirror site to use. I'm just going to save this to my downloads directory. So once the download is complete, I'm just going to go to that folder. And I'm just going to right click on the zip file and just extract it. So I'm just going to extract it to an automation folder I already have on my local drive. So once you extract Eclipse, if you go to the directory where you extracted it to, double click on the Eclipse folder, you should see an Eclipse application icon. Uh, just double click on Eclipse and Eclipse should start up. It's just going to prompt you for a workspace. That's basically where all your projects uh, are going to be stored, what folder they're going to be uh, stored in. And Eclipse should load up. And if you get this far, it means you've installed Eclipse correctly.